Imagine walking into your lab after a vacation and finding your experiments ruined. That's exactly what happened to Alexander Fleming in 1928. He returned to his cluttered lab at St. Mary's Hospital in London, only to notice something odd. A petri dish of Staphylococcus bacteria had grown mold. But instead of tossing it out, Fleming's curiosity was piqued. What he saw next would change the course of medical history forever. Fleming noticed that the mold on the petri dish wasn't just growing, it was actually killing the bacteria around it. This wasn't something he'd ever seen before. Instead of ignoring the accident, he began to investigate. He isolated the mold and identified it as Penicillium notatum. Fleming realized he'd stumbled upon a natural bacteria killer, but he had no idea just how powerful this discovery would become. The real challenge began after the discovery. Fleming struggled to extract and purify the active substance from the mold. He called it penicillin. Despite his efforts, producing penicillin in large quantities seemed impossible with the technology of the time. Fleming published his findings, but the world wasn't ready to listen. For years, penicillin remained a scientific curiosity, its potential to save lives still untapped and largely ignored by the medical community. It wasn't until a decade later that scientists Howard Florey, Ernst Chain, and their team at Oxford picked up where Fleming left off. They developed methods to mass-produce penicillin, just as World War II was raging. Suddenly, this mold-derived medicine became a lifesaver for wounded soldiers, treating infections that would have otherwise been fatal. The world finally recognized the true value of Fleming's accidental discovery, and penicillin's impact was unstoppable. Penicillin's discovery marked the dawn of the antibiotic era, transforming medicine and saving countless lives. What began as a messy accident in Fleming's lab became one of humanity's greatest weapons against disease. Today, we take antibiotics for granted, but it all started with a curious mind and a bit of luck. Next time you hear about a scientific breakthrough, remember, sometimes the biggest changes come from the most unexpected places.